this is a red letter day in the careers of hundreds of members of the Women's Auxiliary Australian Air Force. These daughters of the Southern Cross have passed through their preliminary training and are to be drafted to various stations. Under the guidance of competent officers, the girls are quick to adapt themselves to the precision required by our Air Force. Her Excellency, Lady Wakehurst, accompanied by senior officers of the service, takes the salute as the WAPs pass with the typical Air Force march. Dignity and precision personified. Coming from all walks of life, these girls have sacrificed careers and social life to give their services to their country. Individual ambition has been thrust aside. Each is but a part of a huge and efficient organization pledged to victory. Secret messages of vital importance are entrusted to the girls operating radio transmitting and receiving equipment. Photographing of the sending of any message is not permitted. This operator expresses her sentiment by repeating the call, V for victory. Teletype machines maintain direct contact with all stations, and here again the strictest secrecy must be observed in the transmission and reception of all messages. For 24 hours a day, every day, operators are on duty, sending and receiving with a precision which commands admiration. The duties of the webs are many and varied, and the cheerfulness of the girls, no matter what their job, is an inspiration to all of us. The packing and inspection of parachutes is not only laborious, but it is exacting, for the valuable life of an airman may be sacrificed by carelessness. The checking of the multitude of implements of war in the main is in the hands of these volunteers. Not one defect passes without question. Transport, too, comes within the orbit of their work. The manner in which these girls service and handle huge trucks calls for nothing but admiration. The WEF's organization is a very real and vital part of Australia's great war machine. Every member accepts her job in deadly earnest. Everyone a capable and determined unit of a force governed by tradition and discipline. While the Royal Australian Air Force is fighting in the field, the WEFs are on the job to ensure ample supplies and maintain communications. The arduous work and concentration of the service is offset with time for relaxation. With official duties behind them for a few hours, the light-hearted spirit of Australian womanhood holds sway. These girls are doing a grand job. That's after them. Thank you.